Hi, I'm Zach Kazahusky from GolfWRX.com. I'm here with Rocky Shi, Director of Product Development for Nike Golf. Now, Rock, for 2013, you have two premium golf balls, the 20XI and the 20XIX, which are going to retail around $45. Yep. But for players that maybe don't want to spend that much for a dozen or have slightly slower club head speeds, you have a different line of golf balls. Yes. Tell me a little bit about those. One resin, one resin X. Like okay. you mentioned, it's same technology, resin core. Right. It's now available to uh, you know amateur or low swing speed player with uh, you know affordable price. Okay. So what we did is same resin technology, and uh, you know starting cover, which is distance type cover. It's going to spin less around the green. Less spin around the green too, but with it's way softer compression. It's a 60. One resin is 60 compression. One resin X is 65. Mm -hmm. Versus 80, 85, 20 X side. And XIX, okay. so 20 points different is huge. Right. So even though you don't get spin around green, you feel, you feel, you know, the golf ball stays on the face and nicely, uh, you know, uh, uh, jumps off you know, with higher launch, softly landed on the green. So it's actually, you know, pretty good golf ball around the green too. I played you know, a couple of times and I don't have any issue with spin. Now I know golf balls to an extent are all player dependent. But what swing speed range should probably gravitate to this ball more than the other one? I would say, you know, 90 is a great, but even below 80 or, you know, 70 area, this is a great golf ball because of the compression and less spin distance cover and raising speed. So I would say like 80, 85, we're looking for distance of not only this, I mean driver, but irons, you know, mid iron, short iron, this is a golf ball you should try. Rock, thank you so much for spending time with us here. The Nike One Resin and One Resin X is going to retail for $29.99. And Rock, when is that going to be available? 2-1, February 1st. And look for these to hit shelves on February 1st.